Today we will be making it to Camp 3 here in the Antarctica Exploration. As you can see, I already have all my gear on. Um, if you don't know where to get the gear, you can watch my previous two videos. Oh wow, that is so pretty. Once again, we get to see the Aurora Lights. These are so gorgeous. Okay, well we're going to keep on moving because I'm not sure how long this um, journey to Camp 3 is. So we're going to start by going across these ice chunks. I'm hoping that the journey to Camp 3 is a little easy because last time it was very hard, especially with the avalanche that happened. That was crazy. Hopefully we do not run into another avalanche because that would not be good. Okay, let's get over these last few ice chunks. Oh no, I fell. <laughs> okay, it didn't hurt me, so we're alright. Where do we go? Um... I think we go up here. I'm going to just walk up here and see if this is the way to go. I'm not really sure. Um, oh, there's a marker over there. I see it. Okay. So we're going to head this way now. Follow the markers. Remember, follow these red markers so you do not get lost. You can turn on your lights and your flash also so you can see better. To be able to use your lights, you need to make sure to have your helmet. I've seen a few people leave without their helmet and then are left without a light. So make sure to have your helmet for lights. So we're going to head over these ladders now. There are always rickety ladders in every journey from Camp 1 to Camp 2 and Camp 2 to Camp 3. So these ladders will always be there. They are always half broken or icy and slippery. The icy ones you want to jump like this because then you won't slip and fall off them as easy. We're going to head over this hill here and see what is in front of us to do. Oh, I see more ice chunks, so it looks like we're going to have to hop these ice chunks. So with these, you want to keep going fast. They are easy, but if you stop, you will slip off of them. So you want to keep moving and not stay still. There's so many ice chunks. When is this going to end? I'm cold and I just want to go back home. <laughs> All right, we made it to the end of these ice chunks. So we're going to go across this area here. Did that ice just break? Or is this ice breaking? It is, so we're going to have to hurry across this ice. Um, I'm going to go on the snow platform because I think the ice breaks as you walk on it. And we definitely do not want to fall in the ice. I'm, I'm cold enough. I'm going to hurry across this because I don't want to fall. Um, I think we go up here where I see these lights. So I'm going to go up to these lights and hopefully find my way out of here or into here. Looks like a cave, so I'm thinking I go into here. Alright, so we're going to head into this cave. Into the cave we go. Into the cave we go. <laughs> that was stupid, but anyway, I'm going to keep heading forward through this cave um, and see if I see anything up here. I'm just seeing a bunch of water in here. Oh, I almost didn't see that. So we're going to jump, and then we're going to keep going. Um, I think there's another one here as well. Yes, so jump over that too. I don't think we can touch the water, so I'm going to try not to. I think it hurts us if we do, so I'm going to jump over these. guess I'm going to head up this way up because here's a ladder. Go across this ladder. Try not to fall and keep going through more cave. This cave is pretty lit up for being a cave. Usually caves are like dark and scary, but Maybe it's because it's ice. Maybe the ice is reflecting with the light and just lighting up the whole cave. I'm not sure. How do I get around this? I'm just going to go for it. Yep, okay, I made it. Um, I'm going to go this way. I mean, the other one looks a little small. Maybe that was the right way to go. Uh, I'm just going to jump across this wall, I guess. Ah! No, not, I guess. Don't go across this wall. Oh, my. Okay. So there must be a better way around that than the way I just went, but we're going to head up. I'm not sure if up is the right way, but I don't see anywhere else down. We're going to jump over this and I guess over to here. I'm really... Yeah, there's a sign. Okay, I am going the right way. I was almost unsure for a second. Another icy bridge, so we're going to jump to make sure we don't fall. It's a lot easier to go over the icy bridges if we jump. Oh my, somebody fell. Oh, 
Anyway, we're going to keep heading up these ladders. I'm going to look up, make sure I'm going the right way up this ladder. So we're going to go around it. So far, the Camp to Trip 3 has been fairly easy. I'm hoping that the rest is this easy. I don't want to jinx myself by saying that, but I really do hope the rest is as easy as it's been so far. Again, like I said before, there's a lot of ladders in here. So we're going to keep heading this way, following the markers, as always. It looks as if we're finally heading up um, instead of down and into caves. I think we're actually going up now. So the point of this exploration is to make it to the South Pole. I think there is three or four camps. Um, we are making it to Camp 3 now. If you want to watch me make it to Camp 1 and Camp 2, you can watch my previous videos. I will link those down below so that you can watch those. Maybe you want to pause this one and watch those first since they are the first two videos. Or maybe you just want to finish this one. That's okay too. I see another sign. Oh, it says penguin. So I think that's a penguin up in front of me. I almost thought it was another person, but I do think it's a penguin. Oh, I also see a wrecked plane up here. That's not good. Oh my. I think I see Camp, camp 3 as well. Yep, we have made it to Camp 3, guys. So that was very easy compared to the last two trips, honestly. Um, it's kind of shorter too, if, um, if I'm thinking right. It was a lot shorter and easier. So that is it, guys, for the trip to Camp 3. I'm going to take a look at this plane real quick. Wow, this plane did not have good luck that day. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to hit this checkpoint and that is it for the way to Camp 3. If you guys want to watch me make it to Camp 1 and 2, like I said, I will link the other videos down below. And if you'd like to watch me make it the rest of the way to the South Pole through the Antarctica, you can subscribe and hit that notification bell to see my other videos. And as always, thank you so much for watching.